Well, good evening, everyone. Hopefully you are, or hopefully you have enjoyed your day. As we talk about the forecast for this evening, we are expecting breezy conditions with still some strong gusts out there, but we should be staying dry, and that'll lead us into a dry Monday. But as we talk about what has happened, we'll take you back to today. We actually saw temperatures peak at 64 degrees. That was earlier this morning, but once the cold front passed through, that brought some big changes to our weather. And we're still dealing with those winds out of the north and west, anywhere from 16 to about 22 miles per hour. And as we track the wind gusts, we are expecting those wind gusts above 25 miles per hour as we head throughout the rest of the night. And even as we get close to the start of the day, they may drop a little bit lower, uh, but we're not expecting lighter winds to really move in until we head toward the afternoon tomorrow. As we look at sky conditions, we are dry now, but we're continuing with the wind out of the north and northwest, and this is all after a cold front has passed through and high pressure is building in from the west. We're right in the middle, and so we're still dealing with those breezy conditions across our region, that pressure gradient force leading to those winds that we are experiencing. As we head throughout the night, we stay dry, but tomorrow morning we start out in the upper 20s and low 30s. By the afternoon, we are expecting temperatures to reach to near 50 degrees, even though these numbers are a little bit lower. I think the sunshine will help with that. That sun will help warm us up a little bit more. As we look ahead to Tuesday night, though, the following day, well, we are expecting the storm system to pass to our east. We'll have high pressure and control, cold air damming taking shape, and that will lead to some clouds around the area. And models have been hinting at maybe some moisture, maybe some drizzle. I'm not too sold on that just yet. Uh, but again, we are watching that storm system pass by. But as we get back to the forecast for tonight, temperatures down to about 30 degrees, a clear sky, breezy conditions expected. And as we look at the next seven days, we'll see clouds around Tuesday. By the time we get to Wednesday, we'll see temperatures in the upper 60s. And by Thursday, we'll have temperatures near 63 degrees. Nice weather for the home opener. After that, we're looking at our rain chances moving back in with the storm system for Friday and finishing up on Saturday.